This is live from the PAISD with what people are saying. Yeah, it's a discussion that's been going on for years now, but tonight the district says enough is enough. We have taught thousands of students and they have turned out to be great, regardless of the name. Tonight, the Port Arthur ISD Board of Trustees discuss whether or not to rename both Robert E. Lee and Dick Dallin Elementary Schools. Well, of course, we've heard about it. It's happened across the United States, and we're okay with that. But the board will do what's best for this community. Port Arthur Superintendent Mark Portery says only one person has come forward with concerns. We have not had a group of individuals to come. We've had one person to come and tell us what they feel, and that's perfectly fine. That person being Greg Richard, who says it's time to change. I don't like my tax money perpetuating the legacy of some people who fought to keep me in slavery. Parents we talked to today were split on whether or not the name needs to go. I feel like it should be changed, yes, you know, because um, it causes a lot of pain for a lot of people. Either way, I like it. Mm -hmm. The name they have now, they have a new name, it's mm -hmm. okay. Because it's a good school. The district made the decision tonight to give the community from September 3rd to the 30th to weigh in. In September, we will hear from the, from the community. We will have a public hearing and we will listen to see what they say. And a final decision will be made shortly after. Now, the board say they will make their final decision in October and they tell me that once a decision is made, this will be the last one on this, on this topic. I'm live in the Port Arthur, Jordan Foster, 12 News.